Welcome to Mini Orange. Mini Orange provides single sign-on solution for your Shopify store and is one of the best single sign-on solution available in the market. In this video, we are going to configure single sign-on into the Shopify store using Okta as an identity provider. To install the Mini Orange single sign-on application on your Shopify store, visit the Shopify app store and search for SSO. Once you find the Mini Orange application, click install and then follow the prompts to complete the installation. Get callback URL from Shopify single sign-on application. Go to your Shopify admin and navigate to app section. Select Mini Orange single sign-on application. Click on add identity provider button and select OAuth 2.0 protocol. Choose Okta as an identity provider from the given list of IDPs. Copy the callback URL as it will be required in setting up Shopify as OAuth provider in Okta. Now log in to your Okta developer console and select application section under applications. Click on create app integration button and select open ID connect protocol. Select the application type as web application and click on next. Add appropriate app integration name and scroll down to sign and redirect URI section. Paste the callback URL copied from Shopify single sign on application. Scroll down to assignment section and select allow everyone in your organization to access option. Uncheck the enable immediate access with federation broker mode option and click on save. Navigate to the assignment tab in Okta. Click on assign and select assign to people. Select the user from the pop-up. Click on done. Get client ID and client secret from Okta. Navigate to the general tab in Okta. Here you can find client ID and secret. Copy down these value as they will be used in further steps. Map attributes between Shopify and Okta. Navigate to API tab under security section. Edit the default setting. Navigate to the ID claim type under claims tab. By clicking on add claim button, you can map attribute between Okta and Shopify. Provide a claim name, token type as ID token, and the value will be mapped with Shopify. Click on create. Navigate to the Shopify SSO application and paste client ID and client secret that you have already copied from the Okta application. Provide an appropriate app name. Now you need to provide endpoints and scope to configure single sign-on. Retrieve your Okta domain by clicking on the icon shown on the screen. Then, click on my end user dashboard. You will find your Okta domain in the URL. Refer the table on the screen to generate the endpoints. Fill out the values and click on save. Click on the test connection button. You will see a test successful pop-up window. Now click on the fetch attribute button to fetch the IDP attributes. Map predefined Shopify attributes with IDP attributes. Click on save. Now make your configured IDP as a default identity provider for single sign-on. Let's see how single sign-on application works for end users. Now you can see the login with mini orange button is activated on your Shopify store. Click on SSO button. You will be redirected to Okta login page. Log in with your existing Okta account. You have successfully logged into Shopify store using Okta. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, reach out to us at Shopify support at the